and welcome back. On today, I have an exciting video and a special guest. The special guest on today is no other than my husband, Chris. <laughs> he is going to pick out his five top handbags in my luxury collection. And after he pick out his top five, we are going to discuss why he chose these handbags. Before we get started, make sure you view my past videos, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend how much fun we have over here. Don't forget to visit your girl on Instagram at Marquita LV Luxury. Now that we have all that out the way, you guys know exactly what to do. Go grab some wine or some tea and a light snack. Hurry back so we can get started because you're going to need it. <laughs> got the tea but we are not just going to talk about LV. I am going to give my husband between five to seven minutes. I think that's enough time. I am going to let him pick out these handbags and I am going to leave out. So peace. <laughs> okay guys so I wanted this to honestly be something real because this is something that I want to know as well as just, you know, being his wife, I want to know what luxury handbags in my collection that he honestly really, really likes because I want to start wearing those more. It's my husband. So I want to see him happy. I want to look good for him. And so um, this is something I am actually interested in because I've never even took the time to even, you know, just ask. As a woman, we don't ask these things. Um, they usually tell us, but hey, you know, my fashion is different from his. And so I'm excited to see what five handbags he picks out. But I hope it's no handbags that I have never worn, um, that I'm really not just interested in. <laughs> uh, so we are going to see. I told him I'm giving him five to seven minutes and let him go ahead and pick out. And then we are going to discuss why he chose these five handbags so guys thank you so much for your patience i am super excited i hope you guys are still sipping that wine or that tea because i am a little bit nervous i hope he does a good job and he better pick something from the reverse monogram section in my closet and if not so guys just stick around um i am going to check back in and hey i'm excited okay guys so we are back and he picked out his top five um <laughs> um oh <laughs> but, okay so yeah his top five not my top five so um let's get started i am going to grab the first no i'm gonna let him grab the first one and do you have a specific order no specific order so this is just the ones that you like, your top five out of my entire luxury handbag collection. Um, well, it was, you know, that was hard. You have a hard. lot of nice bags, but, but these are unique. The one is, okay. That's their nothing. This is the first one. <laughs> the Dior Saddlebag. Okay, so this is the first one. And why did you choose this one? What was the reason? What was it? What's so unique about the bag that you like? The the design, the print on it, the look, the shape, like, and then the initials. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, the initials. <laughs> okay. Okay. So guys, hey, if you have this in your collection, let me know what you think. Do you agree with this? I mean, you guys have seen my my luxury handbag collection, and this is one of the ones that. He picked. This bag is sexy. This is a sexy bag. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so he said this is sexy. Girl, yeah, this is a sexy bag. <laughs> okay, guys, so this is one. So I am going to put this behind me. Put that one in the back. Okay. The next he picked out the Hi. other Dior bag. So, guys, hold Undeniable. on. <laughs> Undeniable. He loves this 
bag. So you remember when I first purchased, I was so in love with this Dior bag. Um, I do reach for it every now and then. You guys know I am a fan of the uh the feet at the bottom protecting the bottom base of the bag so that's one of my favorite parts and also the tote handle and i am loving the bag charms that's actually attached to the bag so i do like this bag um it's not one of my favorites but um it is it's the same <laughs> my favorite. it's your favorite it's his favorite but it's not my favorite so <laughs> Give his bag. Take your bag. <laughs> so that is most definitely um <laughs> not one of my favorites. But hey guys, let's just keep going because I'm kind of getting upset here. I'm getting upset here. Okay, so the next one, guys, the Demir Azura Never Full MM with the Rose Ballerine Pink inside. Um, okay, guys, you know, I am just now getting into this print. This is it wasn't a favorite print. Um, I have never worn this bag, so it is brand new. I've been having this bag for like two years now. Um, but this is one of his favorites. Yeah, two years and I've never worn it. <laughs> I've never worn this bag. It's a so, pretty bag. I yes, like it bag. is. Oh no, I am absolutely loving the Demir Azure print, guys. This is most definitely a spring summertime bag. And I am going to pull this bag out. I did tell you guys in a recent video, I was actually going to start wearing this print a lot more. So I'm actually excited. You know, that is a sign. So I'm actually excited that he actually chose this bag. It's just not one of my favorites right now, but I am starting to love this print. So you did a good job. I like this one. Yeah. It's clean. It's, it's clean. clean. It's nice. It's yeah. I'm starting to really, really get into that print. I really am. Okay. And so the next one is boss the big bag. boss bag. Yes. I do love this bag. This is actually the most expensive uh, purchase in my collection. I absolutely love this bag. It did not come with this bag tag. This is something that I bought off the LV website some years back. And I just thought it was just a good addition to add to the bag and i i love the strap yes absolutely gorgeous and beautiful so this is most definitely a boss bag and look at the bottom you know i love the gold hardware feet i love the protection at the bottom so this most definitely is a boss bag guys and this is the gm size so yes you did awesome by picking this um it's still not one of my favorites <laughs> but i can see why you chose this bag because it most definitely is a boss bag i love the look power bag it is this is most definitely a power bag yeah okay you see your girl oh see oh, hey. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so yes i do love it so hey good job good job so yes i do love it so that one to the bag um, wait, you know what? Let's go into some details because I, I don't think I ever, let me take the stuffing out. I know you guys probably want to see. It does have the ostrich lining inside as well. Here it okay, is. Nice. <laughs> and I have worn this bag, I would say twice. I think twice. I've been having it for what, three years now? Three years. So it does have the ostrich trimming here at the top. Okay, and it does have double zip here. You guys know how I love to have secured zippers for all of the card holders. Guys, this is a lot of room, and this is the GM size. And so this was a special edition release. Let me get this zipped. Okay. Wow. Here it is. This is a beautiful bag. And here at the front, additional room. And I still have the plastic wrapping around. You know how I love to protect the gold hardware. And it does have a large, deep pocket here at the front. So this holds up a lot. Yes, it is. This is a very, very beautiful bag. It is a boss bag, a showstopper. And also, guys, you know we love the detachable straps. So the strap does come off. So if I want to use it on another bag, I sure you can, and it is adjustable as well. Nice. 
Okay, so yes, guys, this is a boss bag. I love it, love it, love it. Get it, girl. 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 <laughs> okay, guys. So the last bag that my husband chose. You remember what I told you guys? You remember? He better have picked something from that reverse monogram, okay? This isn't my favorite from the reverse monogram, but I am just happy that he did choose something out of the reverse monogram collection. And here is the LV Cans bag, guys. He loves this handbag. Why do you love this handbag so much? Uh, sexy, it's convenient, it looks nice, it's unique. You know, it doesn't seem like something you'll see a lot of people with. Yeah. I actually like this bag. Yeah, I do, guys. And I just got done talking about this. I went over my reverse monogram collection with you guys. And this is a nice bag. I absolutely love the structure of the bag. Um, Yeah, it is convenient. Of course, it does have one zipper. And it holds a lot, guys. It really does. I love the soft uh, microfiber material inside. And the top handle, you know how I feel about top handles. You can always add a bandeau to the top. You can also add a bag charm as well. So yes, I totally understand why he chose this bag and because it's reverse monogram. You cannot go wrong with that print. So I am absolutely happy he did add something <laughs> from the reverse monogram print to his top five. So guys, let me know if you guys know my collection. You know my collection. And in the bags that he chose, guys, would you have chose any of these bags? And if so, which ones would you have chose? Guys, I am just so shocked. He didn't pick anything from YSL. Not a bag from YSL, but hey. I like YSL. You have a big collection, so it made it really yeah, hard. It's, yeah. not, it's not easy to pick. Five. I think him pick five <laughs> out of the closet, guys. So he honestly did good, but he picked both bags from Dior. Maybe we should come up with a part two. Yeah, yeah, yeah we're gonna have to. Two. We're gonna, yeah, we we have yeah. to. But you did pick out your top five. Yes, I did. Pick so it. that was your top five, guys. He picked both Dior bags. Okay. I like hey, Dior. He loves Dior. You know what? What is your favorite luxury brand? Honestly, for me, what is your favorite luxury brand? I'm gonna go with LV. This new LV? Line, this new men's line is okay. Okay, so after LV, after LV, um, you love Fendi. You do, Fendi, but you Fendi, like Dior. You Fendi like, is um, like I'm, everything else kind of falls like just like anything can go. Yeah, I'm, I'm, Dolce I'm, Gabbana shoes. Dolce Gabbana shoes. You know, I'm a big fan of Dolce Gabbana shoes. Uh, Louis Vuitton and their LV collection is that new collection is live. I like it. Yeah, yeah. You know I'm a big fan of that. Come on now. Yeah, I, I know. I think every sneaker that came out in this new line is hot. It's hot. Okay, guys. So if you have any questions for us, I mean, we absolutely enjoy this. Um, and like I said, guys, this is what we do. I am just so thankful to have a partner, um, like my husband. Who, I mean, this right here is exciting. This is what I love to do. I love to talk to my YouTube family and just having him on here, guys. I am so thankful and so blessed to have a partner to just come on here and do these type of things with me. <laughs> so I absolutely love and adore him for that. Um, so as stated, if you have any questions, guys, and as stated, we are entrepreneurs. I have said this over and over again, just to answer the emails. That is what we do. We are entrepreneurs, um, business partners. I mean, this is what we do. I have a shapewear company. He has his clothing line. Um, we are investors. Um, Nutrition line. Yes, we have so many things that we do, guys. And so... Um, so many more things coming. Yes. So I do not work for LV. I received that email today. I do not work for LV. You should. <laughs> LV, yes. LV cut the check. Stop playing. Yes. Stop playing. Cut the they Save do. Us. They do. Yeah. <laughs> so, guys, thank you all so much for tuning in. As always, stay safe and stay blessed until. Wait, wait. No. Oh, One more thing, that. guys. One more thing. Oh, okay, hold on, guys. What is your favorite LV scent? Oh, she's going to put me on the spot. <laughs> but, hands down, 
got this one in the bag. <laughs> right here. This right here is like a magic potion. What did I tell y'all? What did y'all put in there? These socks. I'm telling you guys. What did I tell you ladies? Look. <laughs> Oh, that smells so good. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>